The Clarendon police have increased efforts in targeting the illicit use and operation of poker game boxes in the division over the past week. The theft of these game boxes have increased in recent times across Clarendon and the neighboring parishes of Manchester and St. Elizabeth. In a collaborative effort between the police and the Betting Gaming and Lotteries Commission, several operations were carried out at various locations throughout the week. This resulted in 75 game boxes being seized. At one location at Cemetery Road, Denby in Clarendon, 39 game boxes were seized. This led to the arrest and charge of 60-year-old businessman Daverton Francis. Francis is charged with unlawful possession of property. Head of Criminal Investigations for the Clarendon Division, Deputy Superintendent Jermaine Anglin, said that one of these boxes is valued at approximately $350,000. When stolen, one is sold for a paltry $60,000 to the criminal underworld. He stated further that each box earns an average $6,000 daily and added that by his calculation, the 75 boxes seized could generate at least $450,000 daily to fund criminal activities. DSP Anglin and his team have vowed to stand resolute to remove the profit out of crime and bring perpetrators of this illicit activity to justice. Investigations are ongoing.